Hey, good morning. Let me come back a little bit. Oh, well, we kind of want to say, hey, look, it's Poe's. Um, yeah, I am running really far behind. Um, unfortunately, I have a real life. I, I, I go out and I go do things. I, I don't sit at home all day. Um, and I'm disabled. I am in the middle of a flare. I am dealing with a near constant headache that could at any moment evolve into a nice, wonderful migraine that will then put me down for three days. So, uh, plus I also go and do uh, daily, I go out to my pool and um, <laughs> walk in it. It keeps me mobile. Uh, don't do pretty good on that aspect, just going out to the stores and stuff. So that's, that's not a biggie, but, um, but like I said, unlike someone we all know who we're about to talk about, I don't sit at home all day whining about my life. <laughs> I'm actively doing something about it. Um, I am skipping a video, but not really. If you go to my July 7th, 7th, July 7th, July 27th, um, stream, my live stream, I did react. It went for quite a while because another reactor was in the chat near the end. So it was kind of entertaining. And then we then proceeded to play Fortnite because I finally got my Fortnite account back and then proceeded to talk more. <laughs> I never knew that this would evolve into a fairly decent anonymous friendship. <laughs> it's weird. Um, so it would be the, uh, the video for having a breakdown, self-sabotage, and memories of my childhood. You'll see. You'll see all the crazy stuff that happens and why it takes me forever to edit down everything is I'm like doing my damnedest to keep my mouth shut. I may in time get it edited down, but I am going to try to go right into this. I'm going to do my damnedest to not blather my mouth off too much. And if so, do it while playing, I hope. <laughs> so this one. We're gonna move to the left. Now we can see we can see the pose, which I know everybody's enjoying. He has already murdered the crowd. <laughs> I don't know why he likes doing that. He he just we don't even see yeah. <laughs> Let's see if you can see it. I don't know if anybody watches anime, but right back here. here right there is the spider from um, I got reincarnated as a spider. It's a anime manga that I've been watching, finished watching, currently, the current series. So enjoy Dippos, and we will get going. Um, air, air fry. I have to have. Air fryer pork chops, okay. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, if you make them with with, with an air fryer, boo yeah, but you probably do better than should. I just. I don't like pork chops, bad memories, mom. Hi, mom. Vlog. So I am just about to do my makeup. The, hi, hi, and hi, while hi, I do hi, it, hi. I'm going to listen to Leftovers. It's one of Ethan Klein's podcasts. It's not my favorite of the five minutes of the week, but I think I'm just going to listen to it for some white noise. So yeah, I will see you guys when my makeup. How is that white? I no uh, can't say anything. I watch Law and Order for white noise to go to sleep. Um, also, your top is. Sweetie. Sweetie. It's if to fix. Uh, I don't see any lint, so we don't have to bring out the uh, lint roller. I did run a lint. This is a spot. I don't know what the hell this is a spot from. I don't know. Nice double chin. I know. Um, you'll also see. No, you don't. You won't hear. Okay. No, maybe. I don't know. My I was talking to my daughter. I was asking her that this stuff, the the hoop earrings and the choker things, and she was like, "Oh God, Mom, I haven't worn this been years." She's twenty six. So, still hasn't washed her hair. Still double chucking for Lent. Also, I know she's got a wing. Sweetie, 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 sweetie. 
quiz completed. Okay, so I am done with my makeup. Now I am. Are, are you going out to a club? Are you going out to a club? I, I, I don't know why. She doesn't leave her house. She doesn't leave her house. Why? I can notice. Hi, this is me. Without makeup. I, I why, why am I? Why? Why? I, I don't see the use other than putting on this stuff to, I just, I don't, why, why am I going to go to that much effort and waste that much money doing, I just, don't get it, plus I'm non-binary and um, I'm still she, mom, um, I just don't like it. I'm just on Instacart, um, ordering more food. We decided that we're going to order today and I'm just trying to think of, because as you guys remember in my last vlog, I'm just like all over the place when it comes to what I want in my life. I'm like, oh, eyeliner all over my fingers. Love that for me. And it's like, I think I just need to go back to like basics when it comes to weight loss, like the obvious, like just eat healthier. Um, and I just noticed that like- Honey, you, you, you do, ow. Oh, go, oh, you, was you picking another skin? Oh man, come on. Take good, take, take better care of yourself. I mean, you don't know how to order. You don't know how to say no. You My brain, when I think of like eat healthier, it goes to like You don't know what healthy is. You don't. You haven't got the foggiest. Point again. Look! Five months ago. That was me, five months ago. You can go look back. Go look at my videos. Five months ago. I... It's been two months since I've... I mean, oh Jesus, I look, I mean, look. I've been a sugar addict the majority of my life. I mean, Look, it's so fucking easy. Oh, I gotta do this, and I gotta try this diet, and I gotta do popsicles, and I gotta do Weight Watchers, and I gotta... guess what? I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. All I did was cut out red meat, cut down my sodium, and quit soda. That's it. I started eating chicken and fish, veg. I do still eat out. It's not that fucking hard. Why do you make it to be so fucking hard? Look at me. Look. Ah! Meats and veggies? I don't... Meat and veggies. <laughs> Red meat. No. Just no. Just no. Just no. I, Amber, I know you're gonna watch this. Just don't. Don't fucking eat red meat. Quit it for one fucking goddamn month, alright? Just quit. Go to chicken and go to strictly chicken and fish. That's it. Don't add sodium. Don't add any salt. Don't add anything to anything. All right? Okay? It's fucking easy. I don't know why. Because I've never been the one to think that, like, carbs are, are unhealthy. But, like, carbs, I'm, I'm like, I'm mad at carbs. <laughs> we all are. And also, you're picking the wrong fucking carbs. I mean, you can still eat fucking carbs. I eat... I eat fucking popcorn! <laughs> it's sitting right there. I mean, I, I'm eatable. I mean, come on. Mind you, I, I dip it in butter, but I mean, it's, still, it's usually only a tablespoon of butter, but. Why does she make this to be so hard? I don't get it. I, di I don't. I don't. Right now, like, it's not carbs' fault that I'm fat, but like. Also, choose fucking wheat bread. Don't eat fucking white bread. Get wheat bread. And don't eat tons of it. In like when you go like and order your Panera, get wheat rather than white. You don't taste the difference. Carbs and lipedema, they don't really jive very well. Now, is she going to try to blame, is she, she going to blame her lipedema for not being able to, hello. Um, have you not seen the people on fucking My 600 Pound Life? They're a giant, giant fucking lipedemas hanging between their legs. It, it, there was one guy that he had to put this giant thing inside one of, it, it, oh, don't blame that. You can still fucking lose the weight. 
Stop eating sodium. Cut your sodium. Be- oh, mm. Well, and I have lipedema, so I don't know. I just I have a lot on my mind right now. I'm just, yeah, you don't listen to your fucking yeah, doctor. So, so far on my Instacart, I just have a bunch of meat. <laughs> so now I'm going to add some veggies that I know that I'll enjoy, which is like broccoli and stuff. But hold on. Moody. Okay. I saw the tail. Um, yeah, she probably got all red meat. Ground turkey. <laughs> Just get chicken breast, look up recipes for chicken, cook the chicken breast, cook a whole fucking chicken, go buy a roastier chicken. I, I was buying those for a while too. Uh, just just don't eat the skin, you know? I, <laughs> I'll show a haul when it gets here. Y'all, why can't I just have like... Did she put that online? Oh, I mean, yeah, she put it online. It's... Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm stuck looking at her ass cheeks for boobs. Did... Does she think that looks sexy? Honey. Honey. No. No. I... Oh my god. Don't put that up. Don't. Don't do that. It, it it's 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 not a good look. It, it it you are not seductive. You no. Lose maybe two hundred pounds, lose some weight. And yeah, but Baby with a heart. <laughs> fucking, what are you fucking 13? Oh my God. Like a forever Snapchat filter on my face. Like, look how cute. This is one of no! my most favorite Snapchat That's filters. That's so cute. So adorable. I thought I was recording this whole time and I wasn't. Dad! Dude, fucking, what, what did she, what did she see? I would so love to know what she sees when she puts, Dad! can't even say hi mom my mom would never have put anything like that up that that she's too far into her delusions jesus fuck my mom hated having her photo taken i had to take her photos on the sly so she didn't know jeez let me start over i got my groceries and i hope was that a cry of help from the goddamn refrigerator door <laughs> Oh God! Wait, go back. Hold on, I gotta go back. Did the door just? I mean, I would too if I was. I mean, as much weight as she puts on that door when she pulls it. Oh my God! Did it really creep? What do I mean? What? Listen. And I hold this, but I had already put it away until I realized my camera's not even on. So I got some steak that I'll probably like cut up, cook in a pan. No. No. Bad, Amber. Bad. That is bad. No. You do not eat red meat. Red meat is not good for you. High in cholesterol. It will kill you. Got some thin pork chops that I'll probably do like- Oh, just get away from the pork too. Pork's full of sodium. No! Jesus, why? 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 Why is she- I... Heart healthy diet. It's called the dash diet, you dumb cow. Pork and beef. No! Jesus, is you, I got brains. I got smarts. I know what I'm doing. No, you don't. Jeez. Uh, G-S-N-R-T. Don't. What? <laughs> Episode in the Simpsons. Homer was singing. I am so smart. S-M-R-T. Don't. <laughs> he spelled smart. Yeah, he did. R-T. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't smart that. S E M R R T. Boy, I don't know. Oh, fuck. Come on. You gotta go watch the Yeah, I gotta go watch the Simpsons. Nah. F. <laughs> Even my brain. My brain damaged by meningitis. I listened to my doctor. She was the one who told me about the Dash diet. You know? 
but she doesn't ever, 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 ever listen to her doctors. Jesus. Like in the air fryer, got some potatoes. I know I was just talking about carbs, but having one potato. Not when you first start eating. No. Not in the portions you eat. No. I mean, I eat half of a potato. She'll eat three. Or a Never whole hurt recipe. anyone, I promise. Not only did, am I fat and you had to beat on my back. Duff, like I choked on wait, potato and Ten years, folks. Ten years. What the fuck kind of edit was that? I mean, one, one, one. We get her giant arm of oh. doom in there. Never hurt anyone, I promise. Not only did am I fat and you had to beat on my back, but like I choked on a potato and shit my pants and almost like died in front of you, like. And oh. I got some. <coughs> that that was that was poorly edited, HUD. You, you could have done a fade, you know? You could have paused, faded, done that, and then faded back. No, hard cut. Jarring as fuck. Ten years, huh? Have you not learned shit? Um, good old white onion, which is my preferred. I got this- You know, red onions are sweeter. Hey, red onions are sweeter. You should eat those. Loaded cauliflower bites, bacon chocolate. Again with the <sighs> Look at all the ingredients. Makes your brain burn. You know she's just mimicking other people. She she isn't intaking any of this. It, it, it's, it's, go 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 buy the fresh one. Go to the vet go to the mm. Amber, when you go to the store, one, stay away from red meat, stay away from pork, stay away from eggs, for right now, stay away from cheese, stay away from deli meats, shop the vegetable fruit area, that's it, get the fresh fruit, fresh veg, period, go and get chicken, go and get fish, don't get milk, go get whole wheat bread, that's it. I don't know. I figured. Mm. It wasn't even just good. Something different. I really like the O Snap pickles, and I guess they have a hottie bite one, which is hot and spicy pickle. More processed shit. And then there's also these cauliflower wings and sweet chili. Figured I would give that a try too. Oh my God. I got some Brussels sprouts. I love them cooked and raw. I recently discovered. Two bags of broccoli, which I also More love. More pre-packaged bullshit. Raw. I got some turkey smoked sausage. I like to cook this with like onion. Man, uh, that's correct me if I'm wrong. That was a kielbasa. Um, bitch, do you know how much sodium's in that shit? Don't, don't. Big brain, big big brain Amber, knowing everything. It's just this is this is this is what you're doing wrong. This is exactly what you're doing wrong. You're buying all the wrong goddamn foods. You, you just... Last but not least, I just got some chicken breast tenderloins. Let's do. A... There you go. One thing. One thing. One thing out of that whole haul was healthy. Makes me wonder how she's gonna cook it. So when I mean, she shows up with bacon wrapped chicken breasts, I'm gonna be raging hard. Oh, I got the fucking popsicle sticks. Oh, Jesus fuck. Popsicle stick question. Alright, let's see what we're getting today. I'm not here. Sixteen. Okay, fine. These are the ones we answered. Do you think Chantel lies about her weight? Wow. I don't That's fucking tea. care. So when I first started YouTube, I don't care. And look, I weighed about 370, maybe in the care. 360s. Um, it was definitely somewhere yeah, yeah, around yeah, there. Whatever. And I'm about, 
I would say two inches taller than Chantel. I think Chantel is 5'1". I don't fucking care. She's about 370. Who cares? I'm like 5'2 and a half, 5'3". So based on my experiences, the way my body shaped, the way I used to look, etc., etc., I think she's 100% telling the truth. And I understand that that's not everyone's opinion, which is totally fine. But the same people who think she's faking her weigh-ins are the same people who think I'm faking mine. No, definitely not. I have never faked a weigh-in. Um, I even went to the little weight loss clinic, made myself on their scale, blocked it for you guys, uploaded it. And even after doing that, there were still some people in conspiracy theory land thinking that that wasn't even real but just based on my experience and all of that I'm i definitely so do not I'm think that she's lying about her weight I for some reason there's just a large quantity of people who want her bigger than what she really is and i have the same type of audience obviously i'm not saying everyone's like that but there is a portion no, of her audience, I don't watch. Portion I don't audience who care. want us I'll bigger watch her on that really darn Irish and man. i'm just like i don't get it i don't understand I don't it get it's it. weird it's creepy but i feel like you have to be in that position to kind of understand how it feels and i don't want people to think i'm sticking up for Chantel. I it's just like no matter good. if you're good or a bad person i think that like oh why God. does the topic of how big someone is always has to be it's some weird conspiracy them. and Ooh. people oh. trying to make it like a lot worse than it already is when it already is pretty bad if that makes sense i don't know it's just I don't a mess care. okay guys so i wanted to do a taste test of the hot oh, of course eat the whole damn thing i don't think i've ever had spicy eat pickles. the whole damn thing from my remembrance she, who knows you know she's they opened smell, it now she's gonna eat it all pickles. but off camera oh there's a hint of something going on there's a hint of spice one it's like while you're she, eating the pickle it tastes like a normal pickle but it, she's editing now to show us that not how many bites, you know, not bite shoots, you know, so she go, hunk, hunk, hunk. <laughs> honey, you got issues. You have got serious issues the way you would eat food. Then when you, you swallow, don't it's like, oh, it. okay, I feel something. Doesn't change the flavor of the pickle at all. Edit it again. Just a hint of spice, so freaking good. Hello, beautiful people. So I'm actually. She's wearing a red top. Couldn't be bothered. Now, I had to sit here. When I did my stream this morning, I did make sure. It went a while. Cat's on me. Can she get me? With all the shit she buys, can't buy a fucking lint roller? You have cats. They probably treat you like a beanbag because, honey, you look like one. You've seen the picture. It was in my previous video. Currently just journaling and I do that on my MacBook first. Yeah, and I want to journal about shit. five things that I am currently grateful for. So five. Not dying. Not shitting yourself from choking on a potato. Things I am grateful for. And I kind of just want to do this with you guys so maybe you guys can do the same thing because i know like no. we've just been no in a whole different world like i literally feel like a bitch i see a psychiatrist every tomorrow shit <laughs> <laughs> thank you for reminding me <sighs> i have never I, you don't no <laughs> The only thing I've been told, I, mean, I just the thing I actively use is if I remember something, I remember it, I speak it out and let it loose into the world. That's it. You know, you own the issue and like, yeah, my mom did this to me. Grab it, let it go. They're no longer, hi. They're no longer able to do it to you. It just, oh, she lying. She lying, she ain't going to no therapy. I'm in a different world. And I have just been hurting so much and just feeling so sad. And I mean, your motherfucking therapist would tell you, wash your goddamn motherfucking hair. You stinky. You stinky girl. Your hair stinky. Your body more than likely stinky because you got short little T-Rex. Arms can't reach certain parts of your body. Hey, sure as hell can't fit in the goddamn tub. Maybe a shower, but I mean, do you think she can get all the damn cracks and crevices? Hell no, she ain't got no caretaker anymore. Uh... Wow, that was me. But <laughs> I would tell my own daughter, listen to my streams. I love my kids. I do, but listen to my streams. <laughs> Tough love. And just like, I don't want to say self destructive, but I'm sure from an. She got a fat roll in her, like, back here? Oh. Mmm! 
outside <laughs> from an outside view i look self-destructive promise i'm not but <laughs> I'm not self-destructive. Ta-da! <laughs> Honey, you're you're the perfect image of self-destructive. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! Take the wheel. Oh fuck! Wait, he was born two thousand years ago. He doesn't know how to drive. No, never mind. Mom, take the wheel. Oh fuck! I don't want her driving. Fuck! I forget to like think of the things I'm grateful for and thankful for and I feel like a lot of people take things for oh, you're granted. still breathing every yeah, I know. So, oh, five God. things I'm grateful for my fur babies is number one always number one they're my literal heart and soul two I'm gonna say my friends kids. because friends are important yeah, and as of lately I've actually made a few new friends so sorry I maybe my friends are, yeah, sorry I'm gonna say home I do like because you, I'm still extremely grateful for her her friendship who she is God. and I know I could categorize her as part of the friends. I keep but waiting for me, Bruce to jump in and like make and a comment. I also want and... to say I'm grateful for my family. Last but not least, I want to say I'm grateful for YouTube. I want to say I'm grateful for you guys, my supporters, and you guys keep me on my toes. You didn't realize the vast majority of people watching you are haters. Girl, 15 days of uploading, don't mess up. I posted on my community post today, literally. I was like, oh my god, you guys, my video's gonna be up later. And I got a message. Legit, sweetie. The vast majority of the people watching your videos are haters. They just want to see how bad you've gotten. Sorry, not sorry. It's just the way it is. So, I mean, point in fact, you're putting shit up that, you know, <laughs> you know we're gonna piss off all of us. Fucking more lint. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> Four fucking 99. Just go get one, you. I'm, I'm not gonna say it again. I'm not. If I ever get monetized, I need to understand I can't cuss and swear. I wonder if they would get me for cunt, you dumb cunt. I mean, it is English, but I don't know if they would. Eh. On Instagram and someone's like, it better be up before so midnight. Can... I was like, okay, I got you. So I... Can you imagine when I get monetized? I'm going to have to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> it's going to be hard. Quickly with editing it, I just had like busy honey it takes you like five minutes to fucking edit a video you do it all on your goddamn phone you don't you don't you don't you do your filming in the matter of a few minutes however long the video is tack on a few more minutes and then you edit out you do it all in one fucking sitting you know this is not this, this isn't gonna happen the weird day obviously you guys haven't seen it because vlog it my attention was definitely put somewhere else i was completely distracted today so like i started editing 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 and i was able to get it up still at uh the right time it was five minutes before midnight Whatever. it's fine i promise i also want to do five things that i am hopeful for in the near future i'm gonna put connecting with other people that i'm like is that my goddamn screen or is that i don't fucking know what that is jesus fuck like now i'm over here watching it's right there so i can watch that goes with like family, Shit, new friends, just new people Fuck. in my life. So it's something that I am hopeful Those for. Aren't. I'm also hopeful for weight loss. I am hopeful. How long have you been hopeful for that? How long? Quite a while. I mean, all I see is weight gain and weight gain and weight gain. And you're just going yum, 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 yum. For a new positive outlook on life because I just feel like lately it's <laughs> I've been pretty negative. I try to be optimistic in any sort of situation. Like, put me in a situation Rush that is like intense, point. stressful, whatever it may be, and I will figure out something to say that is on the optimistic. She has so many skin discolorations. I mean, it's like, I mean, that, I mean, the skin discoloration, her, her, like, non existent nails, the shape of her, it, all of that is telltale signs of ill health. Get dumb. Mm -hmm side of things but lately i have been such a pessimist and i literally hate that about me right now I'm yeah you got total her hands for improving my stamina and hasn't <laughs> yeah, she been doing that for a while with the waddle 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 fiddle with the walk to the tree the walk back she's just getting worse and worse and worse I mean, we don't even see her walking anywhere now just sitting in that exact same spot 
And last but not least, improving my relationship with food. And honestly, it's so crazy because I've named five things already, but I feel like I could continue on because now that I think of it, like there are a lot of things that I'm hopeful for in the- That you wash your hair? Can we, t can we take a bet? She's gonna go another week, another week? Near future. But I just catch myself like constantly just stuck in this like really sad dark spot currently. And I know I'm gonna get out of it. I have gotten- Oh, 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 such a dark spot. Oh, my girlfriend broke up with me. Fuck you. Ooh, we've all gone through it. All of us. It, 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 it's... This is asinine. Stupid. Grow the fuck up. And out of every dark situation I've ever been in, every dark spot that I've been in, I have gotten out of it and somehow it has made me stronger. So I look at that and I look at my patterns in life and I know that I'm gonna come out strong again, but it's just like right now- <laughs> No, you're not. We know your patterns. You're just gonna keep the cycle going and you're gonna get worse and worse and worse and you're gonna get fatter and fatter and fatter. And we all know that a train wreck ends, sadly. Which is sad. I mean, this is sad that this woman can't get control over mental illness because this is what this is it's, it's purely mental illness i've seen this played out exactly like this mind you my mother wasn't this fat she was big but she wasn't this fat uh, you're feeding into your own compulsions your own mental disorder you stopping to take your mental meds that was the stupidest damn mistake you've ever made because my mom did the same thing and it cost her her life now we're we're in the thick of it and that's just like what i'm going through but thankfully she will lose weight if she if she if she hasn't gone to get her follow-ups in cancer and the cancer has moved somewhere they could just be sitting there waiting to bloom and then the weight will shed it will shed like crazy just like it did my mom. My mom was 101 pounds. She went from 290 pounds to 101. She looked like a fucking walking skeleton. And it again was because she knew better than the doctors and she fed into her own mental illness. This is Amber, fully. And I joke that, you know, hi, mom, but it's like, yeah, I'm seeing my mom in her. Journaling has been an absolute savior for me. Okay, guys, so I'm about to make some pork look, chops. I, mean, look, look at I have no idea what I'm doing, so. This is so come unhealthy. Me gently, please. So I'm just gonna season. You know what? I'm All you have to do, you giant baby toddler, is Google pork chop. Air fryer, air fryer, because it said air fryer, air fryer, air fryer. Google pork chop air fryer recipe. Hold on, I will do that. Be right back. All right, here we go. It actually looks pretty good. So um, these air fry, they, these air fryer pork chops have no breading and are an excellent choice for a quick, healthy meal. Coated with delicious seasoning, they're juicy and delicious on the inside. Yeah, if you don't cook pork chops right, they're they're very dry. Look at that. It looks gorgeous. It, 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 that's gorgeous. Okay, so we're gonna. These are the ingredients. Not much. Um, pork chops. Duh. Uh, cooking oil spray. Probably gonna spray it on it. Um, I would brush olive oil. I, I wouldn't put cooking spray. That's gross. All I can think of is uh, Gordon Ramsay with the guys that did it on the steaks and. Ugh. Uh, paprika, Spanish or smoked paprika. Brown sugar, that's fine. Onion powder, garlic powder, whatever. Because it's an air fryer. Salt and pepper. Bets that she puts them in with no... Because, I mean, right off the bat, you, you saw she was just... throwing the seasoning on it with no oil or anything to make it sizzle. So it's just dry cooking, which is gross. Um... Why no breading? Yeah, because it adds calories, whatever. So for broccoli, broccoli with some carrots and healthier. That, that, that looks, that looks. Cook at 380 for 15 minutes, flipping over halfway through. Okay? It's that easy. And you can cook it with the goddamn broccoli in there. 
You think she did that? Fuck no. I mean, it's that easy. Google. It's right at your fingertips. Just type. You find a good recipe. All right, so we're starting it over, so. So I'm just going to season. You know what? I'm going to have two. With what? These are thin. With some garlic salt. I think I'm going to do So, already, I'm sure he's eating two. Eat one. Just one. Just one. Okay. But no, no, she didn't. Oh, no oil, nothing. She's put nothing, nothing for the seasoning to hit here to, for it to get the nice golden sizzle. This is gonna be beige and ugly when she finishes. Some black pepper. Oh my god, that way so too much. So I'm gonna put it in the air fryer, wash my hands, and then show you guys. Okay, so they're in the air fryer. This is the gross. She put way too much plate. pepper on that. This is what it is looking like. Well, Just some raw pork chops. I mean, I'll show it... you guys when it's done. Okay, so it's been about six minutes, and I'm nosy. How far is she? Oh! What? Only six minutes and it's already that cold. Oh God! I'm shocked. So I'm oh, that's so beige. when it comes to meat, as so is a large quantity of people. So I like to use a meat thermometer. <laughs> yes, I do. What? That's a goddamn. It smells so good. Wow. She... So I'm Fuck gonna it. give this. Oh my God! Maybe another minute or two. Just and wait. It's finished. All right. No. Finished. No. Weirdly, it is wait. really all that I'm craving right now, so I don't feel like making anything else. Sorry, but that looks so good to me. Cooked perfect. I think Robert's going into the bathroom to puke. And okay, uh, yep, no. Let's try a little bite. Oh, Jesus, does she not know Ooh, how to use it? I swear, these lights in my kitchen, <laughs> they don't do anything justice over here. This is such a thin piece of fucking pork. Oh, mm. it snaps. Oh, it's great. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That tastes so good, but I will say next time, no. I should probably season it a little less. That's okay. I haven't cooked a pork chop in. She air fried that? I don't know how long. Yeah. You want to see the air fry? I do. That's his reaction. Right? Hold on, I'm gonna show him the, the fucking recipe I just found. Okay, hold on. Yeah, she's got thin, but I don't know how, they, I mean, they're pretty thin. They are pretty thin, they're not thick. Because if you put oil on it, it shrivels and fattens up. It is just, it's just what it does. But- Other thing. Right there, cooking, the, the, the cooking oil, the cooking oil spray is not now. But you, All right, you so is this brush. one for specifically for an air fryer? Yes. Okay, yeah. so yeah, if you don't air fry it, yeah, it will bubble up like that from the yeah. heat. Yeah. Air it, frying it, I figured it probably wouldn't. But no. Like I said, I figured it wouldn't. Since yeah. It heat from all directions instead of one side at a time. It, it, and no, those are thick cuts. Of oh yeah, they are thick. All right, but it means. She oh, had the one, still... or the cuts she had are good for, you know, a stove top. Right? Yeah, I just, I mean. Or a pork cutlet sandwich or some shit. I, I just, oh. Um, she fucking did. Yeah, That's a I am. goddamn war crime. Yeah. Robert, Robert's absolutely a foodie. I'm not a foodie, I'm a cook. I cook. Yeah. Sorry, we'll go right back to this. Chef. There we go. Yeah. Right, Kumiko? Right, Pub? I don't know what the name of your huskies are. Yeah, I don't know. Right, Grogu? Just so you can see what he did. fucking crazy. Yeah. See, <laughs> put the spider back where it goes. Yeah, I just, uh, um, I, and she thinks it snaps. She, th uh, I'm like, I, I now kind of want to go and get some pork and try that. I mean, it's go. not good it's for me, now but actually inside and okay, there you go. Petting you, good boy. Jesus, how long has been? Not me, just always using my hands. The worst angles too. This tastes so good, but practice it's makes perfect, folks. I use. Wait. Did she not even cut it? Did she just grab it and... I don't know. I'm trying to rewind it to see. She barely chews as it is. Okay, let me bring it back so so you guys can get his unedited reactions My to unedited her. Reaction. All right. Yeah, watch, watch, Maybe watch. anything else? Sorry, but no, she that uses the knife. so good to me. Cooked perfectly. Let's try a little bite. <laughs> Ooh, hot. I swear, these lights in my kitchen, <laughs> they don't do anything justice over here. That's a good quarter of it. Mmm. 
Oh my god, that tastes so good, but I will say next time I should probably season it a little less. That's okay. I haven't cooked a pork chop in. Oh, you just put onion powder on it. it. And Not garlic just powder. It's hot. And pepper. This tastes so good. But practice makes perfect, folks. I use too much seasoning, but it still tastes good. And I'm able to scrape off some of the seasoning. <laughs> Not me being a rookie and cooking meat in the air fryer. Oh my god. What a loser I am. Through this whole like breakup. Good to see she admits it. I have had a lot of people reach out to me on Instagram because my DMs are open, honey. Yeah. If you need someone to talk to, I'm here because I've been you, needing you a distraction and I'm trying to like build. Yeah, there's his reaction. Uh, I mean, yeah, we, we, we go out of our way because we spent years not eating good food. Good bakery stuff. Good, good, good cookies and munchies and all that kind of stuff, but... Alright, so if you're gonna make fucking pork chops, there is no thin fucking cut ones like that. Oh, White salt, white pepper, whatever fucking other seasonings you like, so onion powder, garlic powder, sure, whatever. Paprika oh. goes really Paprika, well with pork, yeah. yeah. Along with that light coating of fucking, you know, Pam, whatever cooking spray you no, use. No, don't use a Pam mixer. Don't use a brush and put olive oil on it. It's healthier. They do have that at, in a aerosol can. I know, but it's still... But whatever. Whatever fucking cooking oil you're going to put on it, you put that on, then you put the fucking seasoning, then you throw it into the fucking air fryer. What she fucking... I, 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 yeah. Other thing you could do is get all the seasonings you're going to use, mix them all together in a bowl, spray your fucking pork chop on both sides, throw it in, flip it, flip it, throw it onto the thing to fry Yep. That'll give you a nice, even coating of seasoning. It's also not that hard to throw it into a frying pan with a little bit of butter. No, I prefer cooking in it. I prefer I cooking know. it in a frying pan. Yeah. This is for an air fryer. I haven't tried cooking in an air fryer. For a frying that pan. That recipe we just saw, I'm, I'm interested, so. For a frying pan, yeah. Dollop of butter, seasoned meat, throw in, probably throw, you know, throw in a couple uh, chopped He's up He's really clothes. good at making steaks. Throw in a couple chopped up cloves of fucking garlic. garlic. Yeah. Cook it at a Don't medium, even put garlic medium salt high temperature. Yep. And drizzle the butter over it as it's cooking, yep. along with the garlic yeah. chunks. It, it's mm. basic cooking. Now you know where I'm coming from, and Irish. Now you get where me and darn Irishmen are coming from. Just this. The fuck! There, I just blew my speakers again. Sorry. New connections, and that just brings me like people are asking like, how did you meet friends? Also, her fucking... in your city if you never go anywhere, and I'm just like, I don't vlog her everything. Fucking... But um, Two recently days. when I was talking about the people that I hung out with on Fourth of July, I actually met them probably like a year and a half ago. I was at a bar. Yes, I was. That's weird to hear Amberlynn Reed at a bar. I get it. I actually went a couple times before I stopped drinking, and I haven't eat? had a drink since April yeah, of 2020. Wait, wait, how many what? How many people did you eat at it? <laughs> <laughs> her at a bar. I'm sorry. I can't. I, I, if I was a fucking, I. Mm? No. Very, very, very fast story time. When I was pregnant with Rob and I had to figure out how the fuck to get home and make some fast money, I worked at a topless bar. If I saw that coming into my bar, oh my god. Oh my god. Hell no! No, first of all, I just wanted to get the topless. You know, yeah, I was much younger and perkier, and but oh Jesus, I, I, I no, hell no, she no. She, that's funny. That is so funny. I like the I like the screenshot. That's good. Okay, Jesus, I, no. Me too, I'm pretty sure. But anyways, I met this girl there and then I later on met like her cousin and then that like ventured off and I was able to like form friendships with people that are outside of a relationship because I feel like I've always just like had friends. Then show them? We are not gonna believe you, hon. You have, for how long have you been exploiting your your partners and their friends. You've been exploiting anybody and everybody you can get your hands on. No, no, this is all a fucking lie. You never went to a fucking bar, ever, no. Fucking cat. <laughs> because of my relationship, 
or the people that were in my partner's life. I was always like in their life and a part of their life instead of them being in mine. It felt like a little bit. So it was kind of cool. Like with Feline, it wasn't like that at all. She was part of my life and hung out with my friends. So it was just like, friends. kind of cool because it was You were always at home. Anyways, back to what I was saying. So this whole like breakup era has had so many of you guys. Hi, mom. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Well, what about all the all the all the all the partners you ever had? Wait, what? Uh, I don't ever remember those. I I, you, you how many times you got married? Wait, you lived in Mexico? What? Huh? Huh? Wow, you're really good at lying. Jesus Christ, my mom did that too. Lie, 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 lie. Oh yeah, no, I got friends. I, no, yeah, no. She did reach out to me saying that like this whole thing has made you stop watching reaction channels and i just want to say oh thank bullshit you. not for not watching them but for bullshit. acknowledging the poison no, no. that reaction channels no put. no i know no no I, I mean, my viewership's going up i've gotten more people watching i've got more subscribers come on no people prefer to watch the reactors because they don't want to watch you they don't want to give you the views fortunately she's getting a ton of fucking views yeah, and she is still making money. She's she's making about ten grand a month, but I mean, fuck off. Inside of the community, and it's not cute. Lacks sympathy, lacks empathy, and you guys. We don't lack sympathy, okay? You burnt the sympathy out of the vast majority of people because they have been watching and watching and watching, and you keep get same fucking cycle over and over and over and over and over and over again, and this is getting fucking stupid. You still can't fucking cook. You don't know how to fucking use Google to look up a fucking recipe. You make life worse for people who actually did suffer trauma. I feel so sorry for Becky. I really do. So incredibly sorry for her. I feel so incredibly sorry for Becky. Did Becky? I just said that. Destiny. Destiny seems to have come out the other side of it of the, I don't care. I don't care. She's picking up, she is literally picking up the Gen X mantra. I don't care. I don't care. That's my mantra. I don't care. I don't actually say it better than I do word it better than I do like like I feel like there comes a time where it's like okay are you a reaction channel truly reacting or are you just like biasly nitpicking and just trying to keep the money flowing by not being <laughs> what money I ain't make bitch bitch I ain't making no money I got 180 I have like 180 view of subscribers I ain't making no money off of this I'm just finding this incredibly fun this is just laughably delusionally watching like my mom all over again and going I can say all the shit I ever wanted to say to her to you this is great I love it that's it you know like <laughs> fine I can call you on your shit that's it that's all I am. <laughs> yeah Fuck you, mom. Being empathetic Fuck towards you. my situation, etc., etc. Like, so many of you have reached out to me and said, like, whoa, I'm finally seeing, like, their true colors. And I just think that's, like, interesting because back I when no I had idea. cancer and stuff, it was kind of, like, so many people were, like, oh, my God, I'm so glad, like, the reaction channels aren't reacting to Amber Lynn anymore. But then, like, as soon as, like, I, I made it very would've. well known that I didn't have cancer anymore, they, like, hopped on the, the whack. Uh, 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 honey, FYI, you might still have cancer. You might. But, um... You haven't done anything to reduce your size so you could be able to fit in the machines to find out. You are signing your own death sentence. I am not making fun out of you. I am letting you know. You are actively killing yourself. And you're delusional, feeding into your mental illness. You're, you're not doing anything about it. Wagon again, the reaction wagon. And it's like, wow, cool. Like, you did something that just seems morally correct and i feel that way like in the same way like when people are grieving or mourning or just like thoroughly having like mental illness <laughs> i don't want to put it like what you're doing absolutely nothing fucking about <laughs> you're, you're doing nothing about it you're doing nothing i mean i'm actively doing shit but i don't have a mental illness i do have cptsd is that considered a mental illness i don't know it's a product of living under someone with fucking mental illness I have mental illness. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Now I'm going to destroy people's lives, but leave me alone. Hi, Mom. 
lightly, but like I'm obviously clearly Fuck going you, through mom. something. And just for like so many people to put so much like bad vibes out there and like the fact that people are kind of noticing that and like reaching out that to me and like making sure i'm okay oh, like i appreciate that so much by the way so thank you to all thank you i'm like i appreciate that people are by the way thank you to all the people who have started to watch my videos i thoroughly enjoy responding to your comments i'm having a great old time really i am this is i'm having this this is the best time i've had in years because i'm one for you and my mom and uh Cause she's fucking dead in a fucking box in my fucking son's room. Um, <laughs> it's just being old to be like, Hey, she's just like my mom. Oh my God. I can say that shit. I always wanted to say to her, but she can't yell at me. She can't make me feel like a teeny person. It's not worth anything. Hmm. Talk about self-esteem being in the shithole. Yeah, it's finally out. And I'm like, <gasps> I'm a real toy. Oh, wait a minute. I'm a real boy. No. I'm a real person. Acknowledging that I am a human struggling Jesus right Christ, now and that is everywhere. I you don't need struggling. to be kicked while I'm already down. Oh, and it seems like that's what all the reaction channels are doing. And <laughs> I just I'm going to had a mental image of her stuck on the ground because she can't get up on her own. <laughs> all of us reactors coming up and going, kick, kick, kick. <laughs> Ow! I broke my foot! <laughs> On what? I don't know! <laughs> oh god, it's almost at the end. No, no. Acknowledgement goes uh... a long way. <laughs> Hi, this is Editing Lynn before she's actually, uh... What the fuck is she wearing? Is that some sort of bizarre turtleneck thing? Is that got that moon top? <laughs> she... Yeah, I got she... mm -hmm. If this is editing, is this the next day? One, she's wearing a different top, so it's gotta be. And two, she's still wearing the makeup! Come on! Clean! I'm just gonna hit play. We'll see. But fully ready for the day. I just want to say that I forgot to end this vlog last night, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Oh, Jesus, yeah, so that's the end. Um... Honey, the reason why we don't believe you take care of yourself, and again, this is this is very pop, not very popular, it's very typical. It's neurotypical for people with bipolarism to neglect their personal hygiene, not bathe, not brush their teeth, not wash their hair that often, not take their makeup off. They just, it doesn't give them a dopamine hit, so they don't care. The dopamine hit's putting it on. Oh, I look pretty, I look whatever, you know? It, it's, it's so, typical of them so i would heavy lay odds that she hasn't bathed in a while um if she hasn't washed her hair it, it looks nasty um and she's got the makeup she's got the makeup on from the, the day before i mean if you just go back you can see see this is this is her right now next day supposedly there you go and the sprinkles sprinkles sparkles sparkles whatever you want to call them are, are all over it, it's if you didn't give us the ammunition we wouldn't be able to do it so stop just stop 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 do something go back to your psychiatrist and get your fucking meds Stop leaving a path of destruction behind you just like my mother. You would not believe the amount of people that came out of the fucking woodwork when she died. I announced it on my Facebook. Oh my God, so many people, so many people came out of the woodwork. It was, it was amazing. It, it, just to hear the stories and the shit she did. Yeah, I, I, yeah, so. Jesus fuck. Yeah, so yeah, that was that video. Uh, I gotta go on and do the next one. I'm gonna do two in a row and then call it quits. Um, a little bit of editing, so this will probably be about 45 minutes. But again, thank you to all the new people who came and joined. I, I greatly appreciate you. Like I said, if you made it this far, if you want to watch my live stream um, from today, the 30th, I do react very long in that video. Um, I play a little bit of cooking, cooking Time and then Dreamlight Valley, and then right after Dreamlight Valley, I set up and I start this whole fiasco. Um, and then right near the end, that darn Irishman came in. 
it was kind of funny. Then we played Fortnite with him, and uh, yeah, we had fun on that, but we didn't stream, so because I play with my kids and Rob hasn't really paid attention to this and you saw his reaction um, Cam just she's like no uh, and then Mark Mark's got he's six foot five and he's 450 so he's losing weight though good on him bravo but yeah so Mama D my little crowd on to the next video like subscribe see you shortly Thank you.